Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it is time for it in a car after having too much coffee. Well, we find ourselves in the month of February, you see. The, the month of all that friendship and love and all those type of wonderful holidays soon to be upon us. Did you send everybody a uh, Groundhog's Day card? Maybe that's what we should do. But what you should do today is send a card to a friend on tomorrow, Wednesday. Wednesday will be the day to send a card to a friend day. Think of it as not a Galentine's Day, because I know that's a thing now corresponding with Valentine's Day. Think of this as a friendship day where you need to celebrate your friends out there on its own day, definitely separate from Valentine's Day. Better yet, here's what you do. Get an envelope. Write your friend's name on the envelope. Fill the envelope with fettuccine. Write them a small note that says they have to get their own Alfredo sauce and tell them to eat it. Because it is also National Fettuccine Alfredo Day tomorrow. Now, I don't know if you consider your neighbor to be one of your friends, but they will also be involved in this wonderful day that is upon us. Because you also need to wave all of your fingers at your neighbor. Not just wave hello. You need to wave all of your fingers. I feel like I'm making these up now. I'm not. I, I'm br All these come from a website. So, wave all your fingers at your neighbor. Send fettuccine Alfredo to your friend. Really, you just need to eat fettuccine Alfredo. Hopefully, your friend also sends you fettuccine Alfredo so you have some to eat too. That's how we're combining all that together. And specifically, hopefully, your friend is also your neighbor. Maybe you just consider them a neighbor at heart. And you should wave all your fingers and send them fettuccine Alfredo. But also, what better way to celebrate your friendship than to... Read them a book aloud. I would consider my children my friends. I don't know if they consider me their friend every day, but I definitely, I do think I have been an uninvited from my daughter's birthday party before. That, that's always a fun, you're not invited to my birthday party. That That's like, you know, the biggest thing that little children have. Anyway. So you're gonna read aloud tomorrow. I feel like this is me reading aloud, in a sense, because this is me talking out loud to friends and family and whoever is out there on the internet that wants to see this. This, whatever this is, here we are. I am waving all of my fingers, I guess, at you. I can't exactly send you fettuccine to now, everybody. Um, my watch is talking to me, which I don't know how I bumped that. But here we are. Now you know what to do tomorrow.